Hello Zebraherd, welcome back to Sonic Origins. Today we're continuing through Sonic CD in the story mode. Last episode we got a zone done and I think we got all the time stones in the last episode. This time around we are hopping into Wacky Workbench Zone. Okay, so here we are, wow, I like this area already. The colors are cool with the purple and the green. Uh, but also on top of that, just everything looks so complicated, which is pretty nice. So we'll try to do our typical thing where we go to the pass and do all that kind of thing. But I'm also mostly just focused on getting through the levels at this point. We got all the time soon stuff. This is already looking so cool though. I love it. Okay, whoa, whoa, okay, whoa, where are we going? I don't know. Let me jump right back down this way, get a couple of extra rings. I don't know if there'll be the possibility to actually go to the bonus areas. Okay, here's the pass. Let's see if that gives me anything. I guess not. Oh, but if I go this way, whoa, the major speed, and unfortunately, uh, wasn't enough. What if I go this way, and then down? Not quite working. Um, oh my goodness. Uh, so all I'm trying to do at the moment, oh, that's about to disappear. Darn, very tricky. It's so hard to go to the past and the future when you don't really know the level layout, I'm frozen. What happened? Something got me. That was a little crazy. Luckily I had a, whoa, look at this thing. I had a shield to protect me. I do... Yeah, okay, I couldn't make that work. Maybe I could try again. Ready, up. The whole background is flashing. That was interesting. Um, This is sort of working. And then I could go into the future. Whoa, watch it, buddy. I'll try the future. Ooh. You're going this way? Oh, come on, that was lackluster. It seemed like the right way to go, but I suppose not. Oh no. The whole place is shaking up. Not that way. There's gotta be more rounds here that I can do. Oh darn, that would've been great right there too. No, I got hit! Oh, that's so silly. So, so far this is really challenging to really actually find anywhere to go to the past or future. But hey, I got the super speed. Maybe I can make something work with this. Okay, come on. If I... That would have worked too, I think. So I'm just going to try to... Oh man, you're kidding me. We had the super speed. We bounced way up in the air, but just bouncing right back down was the difficult part there. This level is sort of ridiculous so far when it comes to all that. Oh, see, I wasn't bouncing for a moment there. I wonder what I changed. Oh my. Um, it's now just trying to get through this without getting zapped. Oh no, no! Darn. There might be a better way around. This doesn't seem like the easiest way to do it, but you know what, if I can get through this point, we're already here. This does not lead to anything, anywhere. Okay, yeah, we're gonna try a different area. Can we just go to the right from down here? Looks like it. Whoa. There's some extra stuff up there, at least some speed boots, which might be nice if I can grab them. There we go. So now we're gonna be moving extra speed. You think that'd make it easier to go to the past or the future or anything? We'll have to wait and see. Oh man, gotcha. My priority is always going into the past though, because it seems like we go into the future for the boss fights. Okay, I couldn't quite make it happen this time. Not the end of the world, we still got through. Sonic made a good future in zone one. Really? I didn't destroy the machines in the past. Maybe it's because I've gotten all the time stones, I automatically make a good future? That could be it. Either way, we're ready for Wacky Workbench part two. Part two. Uh, what is this? Whoa, the super speed. Awesome, that's cool. It's like a little booster. I like it. It's already starting with quite a few rings and a lot of stuff going on. I sort of want to see what's back there though. We could go to the future with this. Ready? And I'm just going to try, yeah, right around here. Yes, okay, so that's all I've been trying to do this whole time. So going into the future, what is it going to be like here? Whoa, this is neat. So it's like a very, I don't know how to describe it, very pastel, I guess, are the colors. Got the pinks and the all the other light colors going on here. Looks very cool. Feels like something more from Kirby, if not anything else, you know? Okay, gonna rev up like that. We're heading this way. 
Do I just jump? Yes, I do. Hey! Okay, well, that wasn't good. Didn't even see that coming. We can grab plenty more rings. See, I'm liking the future area so far. Got a whole bunch of happy animals running around because it's a good future, right? Oh, okay, we could go to the past again. Which may be worth it. I'm trying to evaluate where we, how we want to do things. Because there's gotta be a way to stop somewhere, right? Not only really seeing too many opportunities though, it's just bouncing everywhere. I guess what I could do, like get back up there. Bounce off of that now, come on. That is really difficult to get around. Yeah, start from here. <laughs> that almost worked, but it, but it didn't. Come on, got it, but then I landed on that thing. Oh, it worked, it worked, okay, we're going back to the past. And then I gotta go back to the past again. I'm fairly certain. Oh, but where in the world am I going? So I might wanna go back over there, if possible. Got it. Oh, come on, how could I have known? That was a little unfair. Ooh, we got some extra rings. Could have used that shield a moment ago, but you can see the, the pass sign over here. So I'm hoping that would work, but it didn't quite. Okay. Maybe from here. Oh, what hit me? Oh, you're kidding. That is so not fair. Come on, darn, I couldn't make it work. I genuinely tried, but it just, it gets tricky at some part, points of it. It just, don't really know the best way to go about it, but you know, we, oh, we get frozen again. Oh, here's another opportunity to go to the past, hold on. No way, that was baloney. Can I please just get down there? Where was it, it was right here, okay. Come on, this is some major, you are kidding me! <laughs> What was that? No one B got the, the most amazing shot I've ever seen. Come on. So I don't know if we'll be able to get a chance to actually see the pass. Here's our last chance, I think. We just wanna fall down and it didn't work. Huh. If I could get back to where I was though. I know, I know. So frustrating. But it was, it was like right over here. It's so hard to control anything in this game sometimes. That's sort of the struggle with Sonic games, right? Is just controlling Sonic. Oh my goodness, I just can't even get to where I'm trying to get to. I don't wanna end up dying. See, sometimes I'll land and I won't, I won't bounce. Okay, come on. No, there's gotta be. No, that's not it. I don't know where it is and this level's so huge that I'm pretty ready to say forget it, we tried, but I'm just not seeing an opportunity to actually get to the past. Oh no, and then this happens again and again. I don't even wanna be over here, I wanna be down that way. Okay, ready, I still have it for right now. I don't know how long I'm gonna keep that for. Maybe there's some better options up here. Oh, come on. That was just plain silly and it made me, it forced me to land on a future pad. So now my only chance is to go to the future. This game can sometimes just be sort of plain evil, can it? Uh, the future is cool and all, but we've already been there. I wanted to see the past. Uh, so I could try going down this way and see if we can't find another past sign. So far, no dice. Whoa, where am I? Yeah, let's go up. Oh man, never mind. we're not going up. We're right back where we started. <laughs> Literally right back where we started. Okay, just down here, we got these super bounce pads. I know, I know. Yeah, there we go, there we go. Maybe, oh my goodness. This level so far might be one of my least favorites, not because I like the area, I just don't like this bounce pad scenario. So there we go, it, it could have been better, it could have been worse, but we still made a good future. So even though we didn't get to enjoy the past part of this area, we got through the first two acts of Wacky Workbench Zone. So let's take on Dr. Eggman and see what happens there. So I think we're right about the fact that uh, 
now that we have the time stones, we just automatically get good features. Whoa, whoa, we got more of these things, huh? Once again, though, I love the colors. Hmm. I don't know where we're going with this, so maybe for right now, just ignore it. Oh, I did see a shield, though, that if we're going to face a boss, I would really like to have. Yep, right in there. Let's go for it. So let's try to find Dr. Eggman. He's gotta be around somewhere, right? What's over this pie? This seems like an entirely alternate path. Hmm. Won't this just lead to where we were, though? Ooh, some super speed boosts. All right. Whoa, look at me, okay. So I'm back to here. Okay, I see where we are now. But could we really get back up there in time? Did this really matter too much? It looks like it, I guess. There's a lot of ways to go, to be honest. There we go. Whoa, way up this way. I think the rings are pointing to up here. It looks like it, there's something. Or maybe it's just the rings. It looks like there might be a platform up there, but if I could just go down here. Yeah, it works for me. Oh, here we go. It's Dr. Eggman again. Oh no, I lost my shield immediately. Uh-oh. The music is always so creepy, I don't like it. Whoa, there's stuff falling on top of us. Whoa, 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 okay. What do I do with all this? Am I supposed to get up there? I think so. Let's try it again. It's gonna bounce me, gotta jump. No, no, come on, that was baloney. Tried to make the jump work, but it just didn't. Okay, it launches us. Got it. And I'm trying to hit him. I don't know if that's actually doing anything. But I guess as long as we're progressing. Oh my. All right. Up we go again. Whoa. That seems like it's, it's doing something. He looks angry, so. I think there's some yeah, spikes falling. No! Oh man, now I'm way back down here. I have no rings. So this could get really risky. We're back with this. It's gonna launch us, I gotta jump from this one. It squished me! Oh man, that's the worst. I can get all the way back out there again. Okay, well, here I go. Okay, so it should launch me up and I need to jump over. There you go, okay, I got him, I got him. There we go. So that took me a couple of tries. Very tricky to sort of figure out, but we got it. Eggman's gonna run again. You get back here. Oh no, hold on. There we go, or not. It wouldn't let me move for a second. Okay, so there we go, we freed another group of animals, I guess, or sunflowers, whatever we do there. And Sonic made a good future in zone three. So there we go, wacky workbench, fully completed. I'm glad we got through it. That's definitely the most difficult zone yet. Wacky Workbench definitely had a wacky level layout. Just the bouncing everywhere was a bit disorienting, but hey, one way or another we got through it and we made some good futures along the way. The game seems to be much easier to handle now that I don't have to stress about Time Stone, so I'm really happy about that. But yeah, I'll be heading to the next area in the next episode. I think we're coming up to the end of this game, so that's pretty exciting. With that being said, that'll wrap it up for today's episode of Sonic Origins. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.